Oh my gosh, Michael, why is it such silky smooth footage? And why is it shot in landscape and not portrait? Well guys, that's because I'm using my GoPro 9 instead of my phone. Hey, how's everybody doing today? I'm doing well, thank you for asking the body beat down here. Michael, Thursday morning, fresh off the school bus. <sighs> Last full day of school, tomorrow's a half day. Don't really mean much to me, still gotta run normal routes. I don't know why the kids get out early, but whatevs. Whatevs, yo. Straight up. G. Money. Word. So, I'm sure people are, I'm sure people would be like, why is he holding a camera? What's he doing? I'm sure they already do that when I have my phone up and they probably say, what you doing holding that phone? What you taking pictures of and videos? What you doing? And my answer is absolutely nothing. So, two days as far as working out goes. Today is shoulder and back day. <sighs> Don't know exactly what I'm gonna do, but I'm sure it's nothing out of the ordinary. Also today, right now, this very moment, I have a piece of paper right here in my hands or in my hand. My hands, really. It only takes one hand to hold this paper. So, anywho. Oh, I want to touch on uh, my workout from yesterday. I did biceps and triceps. And I posted uh, that I have a hard time getting any real activation in my biceps. And I had a couple of people chime in. And I appreciate that. Uh, my buddy uh, Mac Bean Scottish Fitness, John, uh, check out his channel. He mentioned uh, to try and do close grip next time. And another guy, I can't remember his name, but he recommended that I do something called 21s, where you do a set of seven from your legs up to 90 degrees, and then from 90, 90 degrees up to your chest do seven and then do full range from your legs up to your chest for seven and see how that feels so i'm going to try that i'm going to try those two methods next arm day and see how that goes so i appreciate the help now on to amazing things the most amazing things ever i have some stuff wrote down here on this piece of paper that i'm about to drop so i just want to do some channel shout outs guys and uh it's a pretty long list i got 14 people that i got wrote down 14 channels uh that i watch on a regular basis uh, as far as fitness goes and uh i just felt like i needed to give everybody a little shout out and uh so let's get started because it's a pretty long list and it's in no particular order it's just how it shows up in my subscription feed so anyway we have my buddy john over at mac bean scottish fitness he's a older fella like myself representing the people over the age of 40 we'll say and uh he's a strong guy positive guy i think he's a good person puts out good content he competes in uh bench press lifts he competes in discus throwing and just overall does all kind of good stuff he cooks and talks and all that kind of good stuff and never know what you'll uh never know what you might see on there so check him out I mean, got another guy, a uh, pretty recent guy that I've run into. Uh, his channel is Big J's Knives. Big J's Knives. And uh, 
Now, I, I'm not some fan of knives. I'm not a knife kind of sewer, but uh, I believe he kind of ran into my channel. And uh, so then I checked out his channel and I subscribed to him. And uh, he does, he does uh, primarily talk knives. And uh, he knows what he's talking about. And uh, if you're looking for someone who knows about knives and how to sharpen them and all the good stuff and super positive, happy guy, that's how he comes off on his videos. And I think that's good. And, uh, you know, and he does also work out, but he doesn't post a whole lot of that. Uh, but he's a super strong guy. And uh, I highly recommend his channel. He's really a, a fun uh, good person I think and then we have black underscore fang fang 35 uh, he's a younger guy probably upper 20s to about 30 I forgot uh, he said what his age is but I forget works out hard he does squats front front squats back squats he does deadlifts he benches and he's super positive and uh, a lot of times he'll have some kind of a little topic of conversation uh, during his videos so very cool guy uh, he uh, if you're looking for someone who has good form and does the old good range of motion and you know kind of the textbook uh, quality movements of what he does uh, I highly suggest his channel super nice guy uh, very well educated and uh, just full of life then we got Shantar uh, he was going by Lone Star Minotaur Minotaur and that's probably why he changed it because I can't pronounce it Minotaur Minotaur anyway so it's Shantar S-H-A-W-N T-A-U-R T-A-U-R yeah and uh, he's just another one of your uh, at-home gym rats like myself uh, putting in the time and effort uh, doing what he can with what he has and a uh, strong guy and uh, he puts a little personality uh, into his videos he does a lot of shorts and uh he puts a lot of you know personality in that into his videos and i like that because that's what i also try to do i think uh you know show a little bit of yourself a little bit of your fun self and uh, give a little bit of entertainment uh he's strong he's always going after it and uh, i enjoy watching his content Whew. Then we have Runner Boy. Uh, he's pretty much to the point. He don't really mess around a whole lot. He just gets in there, does the work. Uh, he's a squatting kind of sewer, uh, deadlift kind of sewer. That's kind of his forte. And uh, benching. Uh, he does the three main lifts mostly, and he does them really well. Uh, he has great form and technique. And uh, he's young, and uh, he's he's uh, you can tell he's going to be growing into into his lifts real soon. He's going to be moving some heavy weights, and uh, he's just kind of quick to the point, no real messing around. And uh, I recommend his channel, Runner Boy. Runner Boy. And I just recently subscribed to another guy. Uh, I may get his name wrong. Maybe Shiki baby s h i e k y and baby shaky shaky baby or something and uh he didn't really do any weight training but he does calisthenics i believe that's what it's called like body weight type stuff and uh and if anybody knows anything at all uh, you know that kind of working out is probably as hard or harder than weights uh, body weight stuff is real tricky, but he he kills it. He's really good at it. And he's You know, even though I've just kind of started hooking up with him He seems like a nice guy uh, Kind of soft-spoken and you know 
just go watch his channel and you know I think you'll be impressed with him then we have another guy older guy kind of like myself uh, SAF athletics uh, Adam Oga Viggle 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 probably SAF athletics will get you to him <laughs> uh, again he's your basic kind of Olympic Olympic kind of lifter and uh, does a lot of the main lifts uh, super clean with his movements uh, you know you see someone like myself work out and I may move a lot of weight but I don't look maybe clean and professional sometimes whenever I do it you know whatever that is but we all kind of have our ideas but uh, this guy SAF athletics mr. Adam uh, he looks really good and looks like he does everything with good form and technique and uh, I really enjoy watching him because he's just real smooth and uh, I think you'll be impressed with some of his stuff as well then we have someone who's kind of the oddball of the gang who's not a fitness really person at all and that's my lady from overseas a uh, super nice lady that I've met through Mac Bean Scottish Fitness and her channel name is Miss Worm M-I-S-S -S, Worm and what she does is short stories she writes short stories and reads them and uh, she also reads like other people's short stories and stuff like maybe something from, from Edgar Allan Poe or something and uh, a wonderful a wonderful reading voice uh, she really draws you into the story and she does a really good job and I'm not even someone who cares like for reading or anything like that but uh, she does such a great a great job with it and her videos are pretty quick and to the point you know short stories and uh, I really really enjoy her she's a super nice lady and she supports weirdos like myself and John over at Mac Bean Scottish Fitness and you know uh, I can't say enough about her she's a really uh, sweet woman so please check out her channel then we have another female that I've run across a while back uh, I'm not gonna maybe say her name correctly but maybe it's Oana stay fit I think it's O-A-N-A -A, stay fit all one word and uh, she just she's into fitness she does a lot of a little bit more of the female side of kind of working out uh, you know she's not too hardcore doing crazy stuff but she keeps it kind of more based in what you might see a typical a typical female doing and but that doesn't mean that she's not killing it she goes into the gym and busts her butt and works out and gets it done and uh she tries to make it interesting and uh, shares her uh, food and diet and nutrition and all that kind of stuff and uh, just kind of takes you along with her and she does a, a really good job so i don't i don't really subscribe to a lot of female uh, a lot of females in the fitness you know industry and that but uh i think she's i think she's okay so uh check out her channel if you want and then we got another guy that i'm always watching and interacting with and that is home gym hacks and reviews and the channel is exactly what it sounds like home gym hacks and reviews he has a great home gym uh all kind of stuff it might as well be a commercial gym and super knowledgeable knows all the different training styles and all the lingo and all that fancy stuff that people like myself are too stupid to know too stupid to remember <laughs> but uh he does a fantastic job and uh you know he has home gym equipment that's you know kind of on a budget 
and then he has some that's over budget so he kind of touches base with a couple of different crowds super strong has a good physique takes care of himself and uh, he even has a dad that was a bodybuilder at one time and now I think he's working out a little bit again and uh, he just uploaded a video a few days ago with him and his dad working out which really touched me uh, it was uh, really neat to see something like that so home gym hacks and reviews highly recommend him uh, we have another guy bad body not so fit all one word bad body not so fit and uh, he does a lot of working out but he also does a lot of like stretching and kicking and jumping and he's a push-up king he can do all kinds of push-ups he's crazy and uh, it's amazing to see him do some of the stuff he does you know there's a lot of stuff to do other than just moving some weights and uh, between him and uh, Sheiky Baby, <laughs> if I was saying his name right, uh, they're two of my different guys. You know, they might do some weight training, but they also do some other interesting uh, fitness related exercises. So uh, he's a pretty cool guy. He also uploads like a lot of food videos. He eats some bad foods too, so jump on him. Get on him about that. Need to quit that bad body not so fit but eat good Whew. even though some of the food does look pretty good all right let's move on to another guy another guy who toughs it out at home and just you know does the home gym thing like me uh trey engel trey engel he uh super strong guy he can bench 400 and probably 400 plus i don't remember what he's put up but you know he does some good at home just roughing it out kind of lifts kind of like i do uh, he don't put on quite he don't do like kind of the show like i do uh you know where you just touch base with your people and try to do kind of more of a show he just straight to the point puts out videos and uh he's a strong guy I mean, he does some strong stuff and he does it at home you know with no spotters like myself uh, he has spotter arms on his bench but still you know things can always go wrong so uh he's just one of those that grinds and uh puts in the time and effort and uh, he does some good curls super strong on some curls some strict curls and even some uh cheat curls does all that kind of stuff so I, I recommend him i like the guys kind of like myself who kick butt at home you know you don't have other people out there pushing you and you know you're not in the gym around all the hype and all the craziness and you're just kind of killing it at home you know i like i like seeing a lot of that i like all of it but i, I do have respect for the home gymmers then we have a new guy i've hooked up with recently arctic fitness uh he does uh all your basic working out at home he does it at home looks like a lot of stuff and also he rides bikes and i like that because i'm a former cyclist i uh, started cycling in 2016 and stopped in i don't know 2021 or 22 whatever it was and uh, so i cycled for five and a half years uh, pretty much anywhere from four to seven days a week and uh so uh, he's a he's a younger guy and he's i think doing real well building a good strong base and uh pardon me and uh he's gonna be moving some heavy some heavy weights before long if he sticks with it and I think he has a dad that works out with him sometimes too. So that's great. That's amazing. I wish my kids would have worked out with me. I got two boys and they won't even touch a weight. They don't like to do nothing. So check out his channel. Uh, I think he's a good up and comer. Arctic Fitness. 
And then last but not least, we have that one motivated guy. He's a youngster too, fresh out of school, fresh into this thing we called life. And uh, he kills it in the gym, does a real good job, uh, strong. Uh, there's no telling where he's gonna go with his strength. He, uh, he also posts videos of, uh, what am I trying to say? Like uh, vacation stuff. He, tr he posts some uh, videos and pictures and uh, he posts some food pictures and stuff. And But uh, he's a young guy and he's getting strong as an ox. I've seen him progress just in the short time I've I've known him on YouTube and I think I think he's got a lot of potential just like a couple of these other younger guys that I see uh, I think they have a lot of potential if they stick with it so yeah that one motivated guy check him out he's uh, just a real easy going uh, kind of guy he don't do a lot of show and talk and you know kind of stuff like that like me of course but uh you know he still puts out good content he's taking a little time off and uh so did uh bad body not so fit he took a little time off so i think they're kind of trying to get back into the youtube game and uh get things rolling again we'll see so anyway guys that's my my list of people that i thought that i would share with you i know it's a long video so i don't want to keep going here too long Whew. a lot of good channels there guys and i don't know if you can go into my uh, youtube and check out the channels i'm subscribed to but that'd be easiest for you to do if you can go and try and do that instead of me trying to put their names up and you know that's a lot of typing i don't feel like typing that much even though i can type i don't know if i feel like typing all that but if i do the names are right here for you to look at if i don't then yeah go into my youtube and look at all the channels i'm subscribed to so anyway guys whew, i'm gonna put this camera down let my shoulders rest and uh, get done with my walk so please if you feel so inclined if you'd like like share subscribe comment all that good stuff to the body beat down that's me michael your incredible host the goofball with the most. Get up, get out, get rad. Do it to it. We'll see you next time on the Body Beat Down. Go check out those channels. Smooth. Smooth camera action. Super smooth. Get up, get out, get rad, and do it to it.